Good morning viewers. Today we're just going to show you the entrance to the physiotherapy practice. You can look, see it's all nice and lush out here. It's now summertime. And uh, we're just going to give you a tour of what the garden looks like and what the entrance looks like to my practice. And uh, we'll go through. And this is usually where the patients park. And this time around we summer. So the plants are all looking lush and green. We've had quite good rains this summer. And people can get to park here and then they get to enjoy the view of the garden as they come in because it's very important to have a tranquil feeling when you're coming into an area of treatment and you can hear the beautiful water now you've got the beautiful stones and many of my patients when they come up here they take their time coming up because it's such a nice view and especially in the summer when you can see everything is nice and the lights are playing on the floor from the mirrors that are hanging up in the garden. And everything is just so beautiful. Everything hanging in the trees. And those that have patients that, that, that come with an, somebody, those people are allowed to sit in the garden and just enjoy the tranquility. As, as we've seen, we've got animals all over the show be they live or metal and there's Silky's little hut you can't see it so clearly anymore because the bushes have grown but there's another hut for her in case that one gets wet yeah outside on the window so is where the cats sleep there's nobody there at the moment they're usually there all the time though but we come up and into the practice now this practice has been accredited and we've got all our rules and regulations up for the patients to read as well as interesting information so reducing your lifestyle induced metabolic diseases and these are all the things that we talk about i also have my books available for my patients here they're also available on amazon and we will do little talks about why i've written each one and how they were inspired but here you can see the tools of the trade that's my dream board that I've got going up there which I talk about with my patients on how to create a dream board and then I've got my tools of the trade so my needles my massage oils my derma bags to clean the area I've got saline to treat my animals and those that have got chest infections I've got cups I've got a hypervolt I've got my shortwave machine which is a deep penetration my favorite chicken and um, that's where the cat sleeps. The cat also sleeps on the windowsill there, which I showed you from outside. Then we've got our needle box over there to get rid of the needles. And today's February the 27th. Then we've got Paddington in his bed. He's my therapy dog. And he helps a lot of people overcome their fear of animals. And we've got the Pilatus reformer, as well as my little scale that we do measurements of my patients on. Um, to determine you know when they start losing weight and what they need to do to improve themselves and then there's my little chair that I work on and the bed that the people lie on and this is the normal view that you get when I do my YouTube videos to teach you about all kinds of things is this is a view that you'll have because um, I've got a special little tripod of a box and a stone to hold my camera up because uh, I believe in using things that you've got available to you and not going out and spending lots of money just for the sake of spending and then it becomes a white elephant in your home we don't want to do that so we try and exercises that i give you are always um, exercises that you can do at home without equipment or with stuff that is easily available to you at home we've got a little bathroom available for the patients to go in and use and um, i absolutely love working from home because i've got all my animals here with me and um, if I don't have a patient uh, coming at the, at the specific time, then I can use that opportunity to do special videos for you guys. So if there's any questions that you have that you want answered or any problems, medical problems that you have, please ask. It might take me a while to get back to you, but I'll create a little video to explain what I need to explain so that you can get better. So keep your eyes on the channel and we will go through your questions and answer them as diligently as possible. Hope you enjoy this video and those of you that are scared of animals you are still welcome the dog will go out on command he's a well-trained therapy dog and he can also smell diseases so he can smell if you've got a bladder infection he can smell if you've got other infections he can uh, tell me when you're depressed 
and I use him quite significantly. I take him to the old age homes to go and do therapy there because they don't see a lot of animals there and it's actually quite a pleasure to work with the animals here. So all the best and we look forward to helping you through your troubled times and your injuries over the next uh, YouTube sessions and uh, keep your eyes open and keep posting those questions. Bye!